Oh, we had a water pump, and uh, we're moving some water off our right field, some standing water, and uh, trying to prime it, and uh, prime it a little bit too much, so got a little water on me, but it's all right. This is the price of playing ball. <laughs> yes, a typical February. Never ideal to start the college baseball season. Well, the weather's just been tough. Uh, oftentimes, early in the year like this, uh, you have a lot of systems come through. You have to get it ready for your non-conference games at the beginning of the year. But finally off and running, Norfolk State fresh off their first ever North Division title. It was a blast. Um, that's one of the most fun years I've had playing baseball in a while. It's, uh, I mean, it really means a lot to us to, to win like that. Are the favorites to win the MEAC championship outright? So we're very happy about it. Guys worked hard, had a great year last year. And uh, like we've been stressing to them, you're going to have to work even harder to get to that same spot. All the work that was put in last year, all the records that were set, you know, that we wanted to build on top of that this year. Last season, NSU enjoyed a Division I school record 13-game win streak. This year, they'll be led by some strong pitching, starting with preseason pitcher of the year, Matt Altman. You know, you have many others. Uh, Devin Hemrick, who, you know, who is just as good on, on a Saturday. Uh, some pr pretty good relievers. And uh, I feel like our offensive lineup is very strong. Uh, from top to bottom. They're excited to prove last year was no fluke. We're excited to, you know, start facing each other first off because, you know, these, these, uh, the, the reps that we're getting, you know, every now and then we'll get plunked every now and then we'll, we'll have a little argument about it. And this time around, ready to finish the job. Fell short in the tournament, but this year we had the expectation to do what we did this season and add on to that with a ring. With the Spartans, Nathan Epstein for the Sports Wrap.